Hello guys, Soljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Indoors. Today I've got a really, really sweet looking build for you. I wanted to play around with a relaxing study and this is what I came up with. I didn't want something so executive like an office, but more like a relaxed place, kind of like you'd see in these real, real nice houses where people go to read and sometimes do paperwork. I have a little fireplace here that I decided to go with cobblestone. The stone brick was nice in the Sortex fanfare pack that I use, but the cobblestone seemed to give it a nice grain, so I decided to couple that with the brown and the stained brown clays that you see here. I did a little plant on this side with maybe a little chest that you'd find some tools. A little tool here and a cauldron that would kind of act like maybe an ash bucket and shovel, and just a plant here. I went with a lot of books here and there. I did a book on the shelf here with a little plant and I also did some books here. Now this is an inset design that I've decided to go with. It kind of gives the room some depth because it takes up so much of the wall and just a few item frames with some book type items in them to kind of break up the palette. The chairs I'm really really proud of too. This is the dark oak half slabs along with the dark oak stairs. And it's really, really hard to pull these chair designs off because you have to use whole blocks in the back that stick out on the sides. But if you cover them up right with the spacing, it looks good. I ended up using sand as the back textures and it gave like a khaki or a tan look to complement the dark woods in the furniture. For the corners, I decided to go with the large book piles, kind of like you'd see a little bit of disorganization, maybe a little bit of clutter, but still neat and organized. I did my classic little lamps here with the anvil and the redstone lamps and the redstone lamps are actually powered behind the redstone blocks that are hidden in the bookshelf here and here within the wall. Now naturally you need two thick walls to do this or something like this set up here. Like naturally I couldn't do it with a wall behind it because the block was exposed due to the inset design here. But all in all the design came out really really good. I actually went with a little table setup, almost like a desk setup, but with a few more chairs for reading and stuff. And I thought that the little pressure plates here kind of acted like maybe books or literature that would be left on the desk. The chairs, I decided to go with sandstone. It seemed to be a perfect balance between the oak colored floors and the dark colored table. And just another little lamp there with a plant. I could have done a little bit larger of a TV, but the TV painting actually came out pretty good. This is a standard painting in the Sortex Fanvare pack that I'm using, but naturally I could have went with maybe a 2x2 two two or a 2x3 two section with black textures like the black stained clay or coal blocks to emulate a television. But all in all guys, I'm really really happy with the design. The last thing that I wanted to do is set a little bit of depth in the room with the ceiling, so I decided to go with the spruce wood because it was offset to the other colors in the room and with the three long lights, both in a center. So I hope you guys liked the room. It was great to produce it, and I'll see you next time in another episode of Minecraft Indoors. This is Uljin signing off. Have a good one.